take a look inside the Johan. Uh, tell you what, let's listen in to Mauricio Pochettino, to the manager, to what he said before this game kicked. But in this type of game, of course, there's an element of tactics and formations, but mm. but I'm looking forward to watching today. Not as much of, you know, talking 4 2 3 ones. Obviously made a last-minute decision to pull him out. Does that change anything from your perspective today? Oh, it does. Casper Ka Dover is thinking, okay. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah, they'll, they'll, take, they'll take heart from that. Tottenham will certainly be delighted not to have him. Tossing that to me, Kate. But you're right. I mean, that, that is the one question I think that Ajax hasn't quite Play a chance at a Champions League final. Yeah, we're all going to be back for you at halftime. Your commentators for the game are going Mo. Harry Kane can only watch on. Out comes Eric Ten Hag, a little late, having had to have all come away from home. And you can see at the top that there's a start for Kasper Dolberg, who reached the Champions League final two years ago when Real Madrid gave a lesson to Juventus, Llorente. This is actually the same team that kicked off their epic game at Manchester City. So away we go. It is Ajax in their traditional red and white, but not controlled by Dolberg. Van der Beek, another shooting. Ziak finds Tadic. Tadic will shoot. Super save, Ugo Lodi. Referee has his eye on the pushing and shoving by the penalty spot. Comes towards the league. He is a giant already. All about whether there was a block. And they're claiming there was a foul, a bit of blocking going on. Van der Beek on the lick to start with. And then he just allows him to run away from him. And then he's up against Deli Alley. Just allows the lick to run away from him. He runs into a free area. Yes, Deli Alley zonal mark. Matthijs de Ligt. European club football. And he's playing that first game that had four matches. Deli Alley was one of them, Ericsson another. You mentioned the word just a few moments ago, Stuart. It's Sissoko. In from Trippier. Deli Alley round the back to keep it alive. Challenge as well. Ericsson. Deli Alley. Deli Alley. Could he have taken it on his left foot? Just let it come across him. Good bit of work from Ziak and a cool rather than through the centre forward position. But what a job this man has done for Ajax. It's league final. Summer's World Cup. Ericsson. Lucas Mora. Trippier. Sissoko. I'm sure, it would just be a yellow. Oh, Sissoko. Tagliafico. It's Tagliafico. Ziek curls it in. It's for Tongan who met it. Goes. Referee in no mind to give the free kick. It's on! By Deli Alley. Just gets the ball stuck under his feet. That's why he trusts. Not yet. All his. Lucas Mora. It's a good strong run and there's Ericsson! Rose wins a corner. It's Rose. Didn't reach for Tongan. Lucas Mora. Tadic has the time and space to advance, and that's what he does. Tad out of Ireland wants to show him outside, then goes to ground. Just, I would say, Loris gave him a bit, quite a bit of the far post to aim at there. Can Tadic find Dolberg better than that through Tottenham Hotspur? This is scintillating football. But wow, what a contribution he's been making. Well, great understanding of positional play. Great left foot, and he shows it perfectly there. Side. But then what a pass, and what a good bit of movement it is from Ziek. Hakim Ziek makes it two. I mean, back into the side, he could try and run in behind the two Ajax centers, particularly daily strike as well. And he is the epitome. Dutch master at free kicks. Ziek takes this one. 
One yard. Rose on the ball. And Rose perhaps fortunate that the half performance of their young heroes. Matisse de Ligt. Hakim Ziyech. They've got...